My name is Dana Doms. My husband is Sergeant Darren Doms for the 432nd of Green Bay. And I am the mom to five-month-old Layla Doms. We met in college at UW-Milwaukee. Um, he had gone to college for a semester and then decided to sign up for the military um, and went to boot camp, came back halfway through the next school year. A friend of mine was a high school classmate of his, and that's how we met. Now, right after you guys got married, he was deployed, is that correct? Mm -hmm. Yep, just a few months after we were married, he left for Iraq. How was that, being a newlywed and not having him around? That was hard. It was really hard. I was finishing up college myself. Um, and living in Milwaukee, all of my family is here, and his family's in Door County, so it was pretty lonely. Once he came back, you got pregnant, obviously. Mm -hmm. I went to the doctor to talk about allergies and found out I was pregnant and he wasn't with me and I felt like the room was spinning even though I kind of was expecting it but um, I went and picked up his favorite childhood book and wrote a little message in it to him and when he got home from class I gave it to him and he just just about died and then I handed him a beer so <laughs> Hi, daddy. Boop, 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 boop. she's the best baby I say she's God's gift to me for deployment because you know, if she was more difficult, it would be harder on me, and she just makes it really easy to be a good mom and to be happy. What do you think is going to be the hardest the hardest part? The hardest part is probably just going to be watching her grow up without him seeing things. But, <laughs> but it'll be okay, and um, there's internet access, and I'll be able to send him videos and emails every day and keep her updated on, or keep him updated on her life, so. She does love you. You make her face light up, actually. We have a, um, a big flat cardboard cutout of him in his uniform from last deployment. It's called the Flat Daddy. But whenever she sees him in the morning in her room, she smiles. And sometimes she'll talk to him or she'll laugh if I play peekaboo with him. So that's a fun toy. <laughs> so she'll be seeing him every day. More than likely, he's going to miss her first steps. Right. First word. Yep. Lots of first foods. <laughs> But, yeah, my family will be here to see that with me, so, you know, I won't, I won't be doing that alone, and it'll be harder for him than it will be for me, so. Yeah. Text me, let me know what's up. I will. I mean, I can't imagine you're going to be a single mom, raising a five-month-old, going back to school, your husband's going to be gone. Mm -hmm. It's a lot for somebody to take on. It is, yeah. It's crazy, but I think the busier I am, the easier it is to just forget about, you know, forget about the hard things, so yeah. it's good. Well, Dana, on behalf of Agia Spa and NBC 26 Today, you are our military mom awesome. of the month for April. Thank you, thank you so much. I really appreciate this. It'll be, it'll be an awesome day. I'm very excited.